see. Is there anything I can do to get a light better? How did I do this last time? Visibility. Oh well. You can hear me, that's what's important. I wasn't planning on doing another one of these. Not tonight. At least, but... I don't know. Something very odd happened. I literally filled out a, an application online for a job tonight. Got contacted by said employer like an hour or two later. Maybe not even that. And they literally offered me a job to start tomorrow. Tomorrow night. Like, just out of the blue, I was so caught off guard. I just said, could I start on Tuesday? Because that was so bizarre. Like, I don't even have a uniform. Like, it's a security guard position where they would station me at a Walmart to remind people to put on their masks. Fucking horseshit. But it's fucking $15 an hour. And fuck it. It's not like I can afford to be picky right now. But it's just such a weird thing out of the blue. And now it's another fucking headache that I have. This is definitely not what I'm settling for, but it'll keep me, you know, busy for, it'll keep me paid for a while, but it's just eight hours at fucking night just standing the fuck around. Honest to God, if I have any fucking problems with it, I'll just fucking walk. Fuck this bullshit, but still, it's like, I should at least give it a shot. Of course, the thought of starting a new job always makes me fucking nervous because I'm a fucking weak little bitch on the inside. But... <sighs> you know, for all the problems I complain about with the world, I gotta admit my own fucking fallings. I wish I just had a stronger constitution. I really don't. But, you know, I just don't, it's such a weird thing. Like, you're literally giving me hours notice. Like, I said I prefer mornings, and it's just like, he said, well, you know, for this week, could you at least do afternoons, like, 3 to 11, although some of the shifts are 3 to 9. I end up being 36 hours in total. Doing the math in my head, at $15 an hour, before taxes, it'll be a little over 500 bucks. After taxes, it's probably going to be maybe 400 This is what people are fighting to live on. Something like this. not really that great. But, you know, what are you gonna do? I gotta make a good argument to get my other fucking job back. But it still doesn't clear up the major fucking problems. of things I have to fix in my own life. Still need to get help. I was looking at a few things for a car. A car would be very helpful. Some of the used car prices aren't that bad. I just gotta find one that, you know, you got people selling cars that don't even run. It's like, they're asking for like two grand for it. It's like, I don't know, dude. The car doesn't run. I don't know if it's worth the price. So let's see. Some sort of therapy. Car. I already filled out to get a replacement social security card because I lost mine like a fucking idiot. Um, so that's taken care of. Uh, 
And I don't know what the plan is beyond then. Keep doing these, I guess. I don't even have the energy to be angry anymore. Now I'm just so nervous and fucking depressed and... I don't know. I just felt the need to share that because it was just such a weird thing. Who offers a job that fucking quickly? I, I had to look up the company because I almost thought it was a fucking scam at first. It's just such a weird fucking thing. But it's a legit company. They just must be really fucking desperate for people. Which means this is a really shitty job that nobody wants to fucking do. But, you know what? I'm filling out multiple applications a day. And they're the first people within a relatively knowable, travelable distance. Although it's not that close, but still, it's something I can get to, I guess. A relatively knowable, travelable distance that I can... It's fucking offering me work at a okay pay, I guess. It just depresses me that this is what I have to settle for, and I don't even want to do it, and I don't even fucking like it. And... How is this my life? How did I do this to myself? I got plenty of good reason to hate myself. You'd hate somebody if they fucked you up this bad too. Oh, this is, this is... Being depressed on video is even more annoying than being angry on video. Holy shit. Jesus Christ. Alright, this should be a quick one to put out, so I'll probably have this one up by tomorrow. This is not the end of this. Not by a long shot. If I have this job any longer than fucking two weeks, I'm going to be horribly disappointed with myself. I got to I gotta have this as a reminder. Do not settle for this shit. Stop settling for this shit. Look for something better. You have to improve your life. It's not going to just improve on its own. You're too old to be fucking expecting that, you fucking idiot. You have to do better. You have to do better. We'll see if I actually go to that thing on Tuesday. I got a day to decide tomorrow, but I gotta just swallow it up. It's just my nervousness about starting a new job, like I said. I always get that. Every fucking time. But just swallow it and just get used to it. Just remember, don't just settle in and get comfortable in fucking bullshit again. This isn't worth getting comfortable in. Unless somebody makes me a way better offer tomorrow. It's a new week. God only knows what could happen. Speaking of which, I wanted to try to get to bed earlier, so I'm going to try to do that. All right, I'm done here. Have a good one, all. Have a good one. I hope I got better news next time. Bye.